Welcome back to Ozarks Live. The Ozarks Tap and Pour Craft Beverage Tour has officially begun, and we have Susan Wade from the Springfield Convention and Visitors Bureau and Julie Kogel from Show Me Brewing here to tell us all about it. How are you, ladies? Good. 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 Thank you for having us. Yeah. All right, so let's jump into the basics mm -hmm. here. So the Ozarks Tap and Pour Tour, what do we need to know mm -hmm. about it? Well, it is a check-in program where you go to the different businesses that are participating and you literally you check in. They'll give you a number, you enter it on your smartphone, and once you've checked in at five places, you are eligible to get one of these lovely stickers. And if you check in at 10, you can get um, a t-shirt, and then at the end of the, the year, there's a, the year. It starts now, so next year, there will be a drawing for a grand prize. Okay, um, so how many businesses do you have um, participating in this? There are 19. There, there are breweries, distilleries, and wineries. So it's a craft beverage tour, not just a beer tour like some right. are in some destinations. So. Right, and how do you sign up? Like, is there, you have to go to a website to sign up to be part of this? Yeah, just go to springfieldmo.org mm -hmm. and look for tap and pour, and you'll find the page, and you just fill out a form. It's very simple, and uh, and then you'll get a text or an email that tells you what to do from there. Okay, so visiting five, we get that sticker. Mm -hmm. Yep. Visiting ten, ten. you said, for t the t-shirt. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, go ahead. sorry, <laughs> so I'm curious. So, okay, so um, at some of these individual breweries and distilleries and wineries, there's individual deals at some of those as well. What are some of those deals that you can preview for us? You know, they, some of them have percentage off of certain Mer merchandise or products yeah. that you can purchase in the breweries. Um, it, it, it varies. Now, they don't all have a discount mm -hmm. or an offer like that, but several of them do. So, yeah. it, you know, even if you don't do the whole thing and get your prizes, you can still get some discounts by participating. Now, tell us about Show Me Brewing. You're participating, I assume, yes. because yes. you're here today. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> and participating has been really, really fun. We've had visitors that have um, come through them. Texas. Um, just recently there was a group from Florida and then North Kansas City and it's fun to visit with individuals that are participating in this craft beverage tour and then just talk to them about their beverages and places they have there in their cities. It's mm -hmm. fun. Are you finding people coming into town for this particularly? Well, there are a lot of craft well, I'm in the microbrewery business, but so there's a lot of people that are interested yeah. in craft beer and craft beverages. Mm -hmm. And yes, it's a, it's a nice little community and people are interested in trying different beers at different places. Yeah. yeah do you really feel is. like um, it helps with like your retention at the brewery? Like, do you feel like people are coming back based off maybe their first visit with this incentive? Yes. Some of the locals, yes, they will find out about us, do come back and it's been a wonderful opportunity to get them into the door. But mm -hmm. then it's really fun to see people that are traveling. That, there was a group that came from up from Branson, from Florida, and they said, we'll see you again next year. So yes, yeah, so actually maybe once a year, but it's, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. At least once a year. Yeah. 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 So this worked out good, yes, it's been fun. Yeah. yeah. Now, do you create your own recipes? Yes, so I don't, but our head brewer, John, does, yes. Uh, yeah. How often do you come out with new things? Uh, pretty recent. We've got 12 beers on tap, and they do a good job of um, keeping something different on the board all the time. So it's, they do a good job. They try uh, really hard to make the best beer in town. Yeah, yes. very cool. Yeah. What are some of these other items that you brought in today? These are just some of examples of um, products that you can get at the brewery. Yeah. This is from Mother's Brewery. It's some more power to you. Okay. More. It is a unique brew. And then um, this is a beer from, it's called Gravel Bar. It's from, um, oh, help me. White River. White right, River Brewing Company. Okay. And I'll let Julie tell you about no, this yes. monster. So this, is just a, this is just a growler that you would come into the shop, and then we would be able to fill this up, and then you could take some of our beer back home with you. Very oh. nice. So that's, okay. a, that's just a big growler with a loco on it for people to have. Yeah. It. Yeah, and we can pick up, you know, the brochures yes. at any of the at any of the places that we were visiting and they'll give us kind of instructions or yeah, tell us who's involved and all that. <laughs> there's actually a booklet that is on its way to the printer. It's a, a smaller booklet than that. But, okay. um, it'll be at all the breweries and wineries okay. and distilleries. It's also at our downtown information center, um, which is on St. Louis Street. And this is our actually our guide to the whole area. It's the guide to Springfield as well as uh, Branson and the, the Ozarks. Yeah. Very good. Now tell us your website for people to go and sign up. 
springfieldmo.org okay. slash tap and pour or Ozarks tap and pour. Just go to springfieldmo.org yeah. okay. and you'll find Sounds it. Sounds good. Thank you guys so yeah. much for being Thank here you. today and we will be right back.